Hobsonville is about 12 kilometres northwest of Auckland or a very pleasant ferry ride of around about 40 minutes. The area is a very fast growing modern area. Um, lots of facilities are being put in place for the new residents. There's boardwalks right around the coastline and of course there's the new sustainable sports park. It's about pulling together the best approaches for green infrastructure, the most sustainable approaches to the built elements in the park environment. It's about enhancing biodiversity and it's about connecting people with nature. It's about combining te auranga, Māori design principles and working closely with iwi and the community. It's about doing something quite unique and to help us with that journey we're using the ISCA IS rating tool. This is the first time this tool has been used in a park-based project in New Zealand. So as you can see behind me, the site's currently in farmland, but what we hope to achieve here is, is a large-scale sustainable sports park. So there's a mixture of active sport, passive sport and ecological restoration. We've got three large um, full-size football fields, two large baseball diamonds with full-size backstops and dugouts. Um, but we're not just catering for the, the sporting community. There's lots of picnic areas, um, playgrounds, passive areas, catering for all. It's the kākāpā of Hobsonville, Epilobium hirtigerum. Because of the presence of this plant, it will now also include this significant area of ecological reserve. We need nature around us as much as it needs us. We'll be reducing carbon emissions over the entire life cycle, right from the design um, through to construction, and right down to even decommission side of the park. And we're looking at, at a combination of synthetics and natural turfs and we're looking to provide the right mix of those such that we can get the hours of play up and by getting the hours of play up on the asset really utilises the resource which is sustainable in its own right. The water system in the park integrates best practice stormwater management approaches. It's really integral to the whole core of the project. We're looking at capturing stormwater we're looking at recycling that stormwater and we're looking at novel ways where some of these fields are actually irrigating themselves from the bottom up which saves on water. So occasionally we will need extra water um, so we are going to investigate the use of a bore on site. Um, that bore adds a level of resilience to the system and just gives us another, another aspect to, to manage that water in a real holistic way. In addition we're looking at substituting a lot of the materials that go into a sports park, for example a lot of the sand that goes into a sand carpet field, we're looking to replace that with crushed recycled glass. At its core, the park is a sustainable sports park. It's really exciting. We hope this will be an exemplar and a model and a flagship project for others to learn from. So we'll share as we go. He aha te mea nui o te ao. What is the most important thing in the world? He tangata, he tangata, he tanga. Tis people, tis people, tis people.